Coach, uh, huge Saturday for you guys. I mean, following up the girls' huge win, you guys come in with triple digits as well. It's got to be satisfying. It is. Uh, it was a great home opener, um, the way to start the season. So it was a good win for us. Um, but tonight it's going to be a little bit tougher. I saw your men up in the stands. They were watching the women play. Uh, and that, that seems to be a theme for you, team unity, everybody having each other's back. Can you talk a little bit about that? Well, that's that's something that we stress each and every day, whether it's in practice or whether it's in games. We, you know, we have each other's back, you know, and, and, and we constantly communicate with each other and look out for each other. And that's, that's the only way you can be a successful team and build chemistry. A lot of speed on Saturday's game. You guys were flying up and down the court, not always with absolute accuracy, but there was a lot of hustle out there. Yes, it is, and that, that's that's been from day one. That's been some one of the things that we preach from day one. You know, every loose ball, every 50-50 ball, we, it's, it's got to be ours. And and the guys have bought into it, and they get on the floor for everything, and, and they get up and down the court pretty quick. You got some big guys. You got a lot of height, but you got some real speedsters out there too. You got a nice bench. You're going to be mixing it up today. Yeah, I'm gonna mix it up. Uh, it, it, that's the good thing about this team. We got a lot of depth, and something that we didn't have at, in the second half of last season. So uh, we got a lot of depth, so we can mix it up. We can throw out different lineups and and not be able to miss a beat. Now this is going to be a big game tonight. This is a big test. Uh, Hargrave is coming up. Can you talk a little bit about the squad you're going to face tonight. Well, this squad that we're facing tonight is is. I'm not going to say it's one of the stronger hard grade squads, but, you know, they still got eight, nine players that signed in D1 uh, scholarships. So, um, you know, it's always a good test, a good test to play against a team like a hard grade. Um, so this team tonight, um, they're going to be very guarded oriented. Um, and that's what it's going to be about. It's, it's going to be the battle of the guards. So, so it's going to be a good Good, good competition for us tonight. Now you got a lot of away games coming up. You've even got a road trip to Florida, of all places. Can you talk about how that exposure to different areas of the country are going to benefit these young men? Well, it, it, it allows them to see uh, basketball in another area and face competition that they normally wouldn't face throughout the course of a season. And also, um, the reason why we're playing this team is um, playing in Florida is because the, one of the teams that we're playing there has to come and play in our uh, in our conference tournament, and we and that's who we played the first game each year in our conference tournament. The team from Florida, so it'd be a good chance to go down there and play them at their place in in, in a new atmosphere. Now you've got a lot of young men on on this squad. They're going to have to keep their grades up and keep heading back to class. How do you manage that as a coach? Well, you know, we we do our grade checks. We have study hall, and th with this group right now, from what I'm seeing, everybody's on top of everything. They they on top of their grades. They going to study hall, and they are doing what what's asked of them. So so that's that's how we pretty much manage it. And, and it's a, a, a athletic department as a whole. So that's how we you know we work together. When you first came to PH, compared to the athletic programs that you see now, everything from golf to soccer to uh, women's softball, is it surprising to you it's grown this fast? Uh, yes, it is. Yes and no. Um, for one thing, we got a great athletic staff. And so, you know, so that's why it really doesn't surprise me to see it, it has grown like it has. So, um, you know, so yes and yes and no, you know, because we are actually way ahead of the curve. <laughs> And so that's a good thing. And talk about recruiting. Was it easier this year to bring in some athletes? Uh, I mean, have they heard of PH? Well, each year it's getting a little bit easier each year. Um, and once you lay down the groundwork and, and, and you get a good, your program started and the foundation is laid, it, it gets a little bit easier to recruit the top name players each and every year. So, so our name has been out there, and it's, and it's getting out there even more by the success we're having each and every year.